A breast cancer survivor, Brenda Volgaridis was concerned when tests showed a nodule on her thyroid, the gland that controls the body's metabolism. Subsequent testing of the nodule showed that it wasn't part of my thyroid gland and that it's something that needed to be checked out. Many thyroid problems can be treated with medicine, but Brenda needed surgery. Dr. Glenn Peters, a head and neck surgeon at the University of Alabama at Birmingham, suggested a new minimally invasive technique instead of traditional open surgery. The minimally invasive procedure involves a um, incision that's about an inch long in the lower neck and it's usually oriented within one of the natural skin lines of the neck so that it blends in with the, the creases that go across the neck. As medical technology continues to improve, physicians are offering more and more minimally invasive options to patients, resulting in less pain, a smaller scar, and a shorter recuperation time. We use magnified endoscopes to uh, go through that incision and work in certain areas around the thyroid. Dr. Peters removed the nodule and part of Brenda's thyroid. Tests showed there was no cancer. She went home the same day and had very little pain. Just a few weeks after surgery, she hardly notices the scar. I have peace of mind now that that nodule's gone. My thyroid function is fine. The half of the thyroid that's there is working fine.